Let's take a question here from Paul Robertson, who asks, if there is no Betaflight 4.3 target for my flight controller, can I make my own target or do I have to buy another flight controller? Paul, this is a weird one. Um, I wish you would tell me what your target is, Paul. So, like, one of the things that happens, Paul, uh, here, let me grab a, just plug in a flight controller here. One of the things that happens, Paul, is that target names can change uh, between between different versions of Betaflight. So, for example, oh, no, that's not where I want to be. Here's where I want to be. For example, if we're going to go flash our flight controller and... I look for Maytech F405 ST, Maytech F405, what is it? They change, F405 STD, uh, did they? Oh, I picked a bad example. Um, that's, that's too bad. Well, I, I thought I was going to pick an example that worked, but it didn't. Uh, they, they've changed the names of like of targets sometimes. So sometimes you'll find that with Betaflight 4.3, the target is one name. And for Betaflight 4.2 and earlier, the target is a different name. And either one will work, even though they're not the same. Like, I know you're hesitant to flash the wrong target, but sometimes they change the names of targets. I can tell you that. Um... What if I type JBF7? Well, where's the... See, look. Where's the JBF7 Pro? That's weird. Or the V2. What's What have they done? There's the V2. Oh, okay. Yes. Okay, thank goodness. So sometimes they change the names of the targets. What... Uh, has he answered what is the name of the target? Maytech F405. That's the one! That's the one! That's the exact one I was looking for. That's so funny. Um, so they changed the name of it to Maytech F405 STD, standard. I don't know where the F... I, it used to be Maytech F405. And then they changed it to F405 STD. So that's that's what you need to do. You need to just flash the STD. That didn't sound right. Uh, Paul Robertson, Flash Matic F405 STD. They just changed the name. So that's, that's, that's the answer. Um, now a more nuanced answer to your question is that if you wanted to, you could go into the flight controller. One second. You could go into the flight controller and you could type dump all. And technically, if you do a dump all, if you go up to the top and you grab these resource lines and you grab these timer lines and you grab these DMA lines, that is basically most of what the board definition is. So in theory, you could flat, you could copy those lines. You could go to your firmware updating tab and you could flash the generic target, like uh, STM, STM32 F405. You could flash the generic STM32 F405 target and then paste those lines in and it would theoretically finish, complete the target definition. But you don't have to do that. Just flash the, the, the they just renamed the target. It didn't go away. 